Today's nap time story time is Where Do You Live? by Marcy Bovitz. Where do you live? There are one, two, three, four parts to this book. Where do you live? 50 states starts on part two. Living in the city starts on page six. Living in a town starts on page 10. And living in the country starts on page 12. Where do you live? I live in the city. 50 states. There are 50 states in the United States. What state do you live in? Try to find it on the map. Do you see your state? I see mine. There's my state. I live in the state of New York. Where do you live? Each state has many cities and towns. Do you live in a city or a town? What is it called? Living in a city. I live in the city of Dallas. It is in the state of Texas. A city is a place where lots of people live and work. There are many buildings in Dallas. Let's see up here. Their state bird is the mockingbird. And their state flower is the blue bonnet. I think ours in my state should be the pigeon. I live in the city of Miami. It is in the state of Florida. Miami is on the coast. That means it is next to the ocean. We can see the water from our apartment. Their state bird is also the mockingbird. And their state flower is the orange blossom. I live in the state of Florida too. I live near Miami, but not right in the city. There are lots of houses where I live. We have an orange tree in our backyard. I like to swim in the pool. Well, my godparents lived in Florida. They had an orange tree and a lemon tree in their backyard. Living in a town. I live in the town of Stonington. It is in the state of Maine. A town is smaller than a city. There aren't as many big buildings. There aren't as many people. My dad runs a lobster boat. Ooh, I have to become friends with them. Their state bird is the chickadee. And their state flower is the white pine cone. I need some of that main lobster. Yum. Living in the country. I live in the state of Montana, but I don't live in a city or a town. I live out in the country on a ranch. The nearest town is Big Timber. We have to drive many miles to get there. We have cattle and horses on our farm. Their state bird is the western meadowlark, and their state flower is the bitterroot. We live in different states. We live in different places. There's Montana, way up north in the west. There's Dallas in the south, in the middle of the country. Here's Florida in the north, I mean in the southeast. And here's Maine in the northeast.
But we all share one thing. We all share one country. Our country is the United States. Okay, I need to see more diversity here, folks. Yep, because America is diverse. Let's see what it says here. Things to know. Where do you live? A city is more than just a place where many thousands or millions of people live. A city is an independent community with its own elected leaders, special laws, police officers, firefighters, and other services. Most cities have either a mayor or a city manager who leads the community. A town is smaller than a city. In some states, the words village and hamlet are used for communities smaller than towns. The first American flag flew on June 4th, 1777. It had 13 stripes and 13 stars representing the 13 col colonies. Stars were added to the flag as territories became states. The first three states were Delaware, Pennsylvania, and New Jersey. Alaska and Hawaii became the 49th and 50th states in 1959. The U.S. Mint began issuing 50 new quarters between 1999 and 2008 to commemorate all the states in the order in which they were incorporated into the United States. Things to do. Introduce yourselves to some symbols used on the maps. Then provide yourself with a map of your own area to examine. Find your city and your town, your parks and your school, and other symbols such as the train stations and maybe even the closest highway to your house. Then you can make your own book like this and then share it with us. I'd be so happy to see that on my page. We can discuss all of the different states. And maybe even if your parents or grandparents came from somebody else, you can include those license plates, those state flags, the birds, and maybe even the state flower. That would be nice to see where all of our families have come. All right. That concludes today's nap time, story time, and it's time for you to go take your 